notionplusmonday.com how to integrate monday.com with notion hello guys and welcome back in today's video we are gonna see how you can integrate monday.com into your notion yes that's right you can integrate your monday.com project into your notion it's very easy and that's what i'm gonna teach you today so watch till end and let's continue to the main video so first of all what you need to do is obviously you have to open your notion.so it's an amazing platform which is used for project management management task management crm and marketing management and etc uh, etc et stuff so i'm going to basically show you two ways that you can integrate your monday.com project or your board into your notion so for that purpose you have to uh, after opening your notion go on to add a blank page and now what you're going to do is when you add a blank page you have a couple of options that you can add in this page for example i'm going to name the title of this page to monday.com integration or just monday dot com so that i know that this page belongs to monday.com and when i open this page i'm going to see monday right here so i'm going to click on more here you can see that you have an option of add new you can import templates table board timeline calendar and more so just click on the import section and here you can see that you can import data from all of these softwares into your Notion. You have Asana, Evernote, Trello, uh, Confluence, etc. But you don't have the exact option of Monday.com. So for that purpose, what you're going to do is you can click on this option which says HTML. Go on to that. And now what you're going to do is you can add the link of your money.com board or your project into your notion so after adding the html so what you're gonna do is after adding the html you can go on to your mock uh, your monday.com you can copy the link of your board or you can copy the link of the project that you're working on copy the link and paste it on monday.com or or paste it on notion so this is uh one way that you can do this stuff what else you can do is basically the, as you can see like there is no direct import option from monday.com so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go back and here you can see that you have monday.com now what you're going to do is after rather adding an import click on more and in here what you can see is that you don't have any option to add any kind of link into your monday for that you can simply go on to your text go on to your monday copy all of your monday.com url click on copy go back here on notion and add that url right here so this is basically a very simple integration that whenever your monday.com will be opened whenever you click on that link your monday.com will be open directly just like that i just clicked on this link that i have just added and you can integrate your monday.com right here but you cannot actually go on and work with monday.com into notion because that is quite not a uh, possible because it is uh, notion hasn't allowed this kind of integration yet like uh, when you go on to monday.com here you can see that this is my mock project and this is just simple a main workspace board for me but here you can see that i have an option to invite for with that with the invite option i can get a link uh for my main board or i can also get a link from uh, i can see this you can see here you have board permissions board settings you have archive delete and these are the settings now if you want to integrate some kind of app into monday you can just click on this option which says integrate and you're going to find a couple of options that you can integrate with your mock project for that i'm going to show you what are these options and if the notion is one of them or not so here you can see that you have all of these options that you can uh, integrate so what i'm going to do is i'm just click on uh, i'm going to search for notion because uh, the options are too much and i don't think so that i will be able to go through all of them uh right in this video so that's why i'm just going to search for notion okay so here you can see that notion is not available as an integration on uh money.com as well so if you see that this is integration center notion.com is not available so you cannot integrate notion into a monday or monday into notion directly but you can embed the links of both like for example you can if you want to add an uh if you want to add notion into your monday.com you can go on to the notion you can copy the link of the page that you want to open on monday and you can go uh, come on to monday and you can insert that link that will that way you will be able to whenever you want to 
access notion you can go on check that link out or open that link and you'll be able to open your notion.com the same specific page into a separate url a separate tab so it is going to make things easier for you but there is no other way that they can be possible it is very important whenever you are adding such kind of uh, you know pages or some kind of integrations that you uh, assign a separate page to these i'm going to click on this like i'm going to make it something like this and here you can see that whenever i click on the link and it opens up it is not even letting me allow that thing so uh by adding this link what you can do is you can uh edit the link by this option or you can copy the link from this option as well if you click on edit you will be able to make the page or url and link title you can add a link title to your link for example i'm going to add the link title as monday main board okay so now what is gonna happen is that the main url is not uh visible but the monday main board is visible so whenever i click on monday main board it is a link and i will be able to i will be directly transferred to the page that on monday.com that i want to open so it is a very good way that you can integrate uh, notion with uh you, that you can integrate monday with notion because uh having no direct op option this is a better one so adding a new page is crucial and you can add then you can go down and you can add other details about the project that you're working on on monday.com whatever fact that you want to add whatever information that you have that you want to add you can just go on and write out of that bit below this and you'll be able to get a whole separate integration for monday.com on notion just easy as that so so if you go on to the settings and members here you can see that you can uh, get an invite link to your uh, notion you get your connections you have your notification center settings you have upgrade billing but there is no integration option available right here what you can do is if you click on my connections you have only github workspace github and uh, GitLab options available to connect there are no other option available as well so uh, this these are some basic things that you can do to integrate if you really want to do otherwise uh you can just go on and work on both separate apps uh, you know that's up to you you can choose at least uh maybe one of them like if you want to choose notion just stick with notion if you want to use monday just stick with monday because both have good options monday is more uh visually representable and it has a couple of better options notion is good for beginners it is basically very 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 easy and very handy to use so it's completely up to you which app or which uh, platform you want to use i have told you even about the integration how you can add monday into your notion so just go on and get ready with the best project management outcome of your life and you can basically make every project and every teamwork or every work that you are doing alone very very easy for you through these simple tips and tricks okay so currently i'm using notion on uh, as a free version of notion so if you want to change it to priced version what you need to do is sorry you have to click on the, this option which says settings and members open that up and in there you're going to find billing and upgrade so when you click on upgrade you're going to find the, all the plans that notion offers there's a free plan that i'm using right now it includes unlimited blocks for individuals collaborative workspace slack github and more integration seven day page history and you can invite up to 10 guests i haven't purchased my ai as well but you can do that as well in the free plan so in here you have other plans which is plus plan which everything in free and collaborative workspace and the middle block for teams 30 day page history etc and it is for ten dollars per month then you have a business plan for eighteen dollars per month and it includes everything in plus and saml sso and private theme space bulk pdf export 90 day page history and you can invite up to 250 guests then you have your enterprise plan which has everything in business including uh, bulk pdf export unlimited page history custom guest limits etc with 25 dollars per month were billed monthly so this is what you can get for the price versions when you open up your stores so this is uh, you can go on to get your uh, priced version of notion as well free version work good as well but if you have a big business then you must go for these one because they have some exceptional features that you can use so this was it for today's video guys i hope you found it helpful please give this video a big thumbs up and also subscribe to software is made easy thank you